Performing a control test. This video provides a brief overview of how to perform a control test. Controls should be tested with each new lot of test strips when they are received. Press the control icon on the display. Select from the following two options as applicable. Low control test or high control test. Confirm that the control strip lot number display matches the lot number on the test strip pouch. Then press Continue. If the number does not match or the field in the meter is blank, then touch the NFC tag to the NFC scanner on the meter. If the NFC tag is not available, then manually enter the lot and barcode numbers from the control strip pouch. Then press the Forward button. Hold the round end of the test strip. With the wheel facing upward, gently insert a strip completely into the meter. The strip fits snugly and should be pushed all the way toward the back wall of the strip holder. The display will show the countdown for the countdown of time remaining during the warm-up cycle. The meter beeps once and displays Apply Control Solution when it is ready for the Control Strip Activation Solution. Insert transfer tube into control activation solution. Let capillary action fill until solution flow stops at green band. Insert transfer tube tip into the sample application well of the test strip, touching the tip down at the flashing green light in front of the wheel. Depress black plunger completely to dispense the activation solution. When the control activation solution is properly applied and detected, the flashing green light will turn off, and the meter displays, Testing, please wait. When testing is complete, the pass or fail results are displayed in PT seconds. Same steps can be followed for either control, high, or low. The control result is recorded in memory, and it can be found on the main menu using results and then control test.